is Justine, and today we are about to embark on a Lego Super Mario challenge. A huge thank you to Lego for sponsoring this video and making one of my dream videos come true. Ever since they announced these, one of the things that I really wanted to do was make a huge, massive course in my house. So to get things started and to use the entire Lego Super Mario world, you need the starter kit. So this gives you Mario, your start pipe, and your end goal flag. This is what you need to start, and this is what you need to end with. And what you do in between those is basically up to your imagination. Also in the set, you get a little Goomba, you get Bowser Jr., and you get a coin block. Mario has a built-in gyroscope, accelerometer, and speakers that react to his movements and the bricks that he hits. There's even a sensor in the bottom to make all of that possible. And it's cool because you can see all of the actions take place in the LCD on his belly. This is also a color sensor, so it'll react to different colored bricks. So red is fire, green is the ground, yellow is sand, and blue is water. All of the expansion sets can be built within the start and end goal. They also have some really cool character packs and they have some power-ups for Mario, so you can change his outfits. And depending upon which outfit you choose, will determine how he reacts to the course. We have Lego Mario, which comes in the starter kit. There's Builder Mario, Fire Mario, Propeller Mario, and Cat Mario. So when you hit the start pipe, Mario will put 60 seconds on his clock and then you have to collect as many coins as possible. There is a timer block that you can hit that will give you an extra 30 seconds. But for this challenge, we have to build a course and collect as many coins as possible. I'll put a link in the description where you can find all of the Lego Mario sets. So now it's time to get started with my Lego Super Mario Dream Course. My house has been cleared out. We have over 500 Lego base plates and we're gonna cover the walls and the floors and make one of the most fun, interactive Lego Super Mario courses that we can come up with. I am so excited for this. I have some of the sets already built and some of them we're gonna be building and then we're just gonna go for it and see what happens. My sister Jenna is here and my friend Ed is here to assist with the building process and Maddie's helping too. <laughs> helping. gonna start building the first set. This is the Bowser expansion set. Ed and Jenna are gonna start working on figuring out where the background elements are gonna go. Ed's planning a waterfall coming off of the fireplace. This is gonna be incredible. Sure made this look like it was pretty quick, huh? <laughs> There's like towels of sweat below the table. <laughs> Ten hours nobody, later. Nobody can see. <laughs> <laughs> start working on the actual course back here and we also have another little like TV stand thing that I think I'm gonna bring in here just to add like a little another extra level maybe put some grass on that it's gonna be cool so I'm trying to link together the ground and the water so we have a lot of these really cool little elements that we can just pop in to kind of get each piece to start flowing into the whole course
15 hours later, the course is officially done and we're gonna go for the run. <laughs> You guys ready? Please say you are, because I have never been more ready. This is crazy. So this shows you all of the coins that you got from each thing that you hit. 148. You guys, this was probably one of the most fun videos, not only to make, but to work on and edit and just see it all come together. But the fun isn't stopping here because I'm tagging Papa Jake, who is going to be making a course and also running the same challenge. I'll put a link in the description where you can check out his channel and all of the other creators who participated in building a fun Lego Super Mario course. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.